And now we can get started. Hello, everybody. Here, here fellas. Today, we're going to start with our Grand Prix as we're going to get off round one of 24. Here at the Bahrain International Circuit, the Bahrain for the Bahrain Grand Prix. Let's get ready to get started now. So, oh, let's see the track. And who knows we are. Like we said, like, like no practice, no qualifying. Yeah, let's get started. Okay, so here we go. Welcome to the Bahrain International Circuit. Any moment We're racing now, in our Bahrain. drivers will take to the track and the Bahrain Grand Prix will begin. We go racing today around 3.36 miles of the magnificent Bahrain International Circuit with 15 corners and two good three turns into turns one and four. And there are 15 Keep turns here at Bahrain. Drivers locking the front left tire into the tricky braking zone of turn 10. You gotta be careful when you come to turn 10. And I'm delighted, as always, to That's introduce Anthony Davidson, who'll be taking you through all the action alongside me today. Now, let's talk about Sergio Perez. Well, it was a really impressive lap in qualifying to get pole position, but are they going to be able to hold on to the lead into the first corner with so many quick starters around them? I'm also looking forward to seeing the different strategies in play today. Those who are starting on the red mark soft tyre are going to have a little bit more grip early on, but they have to make it count before that degradation starts to set in. That's right now. Here comes the starting Let's grid. Let's run you through the driver grid order for today's exciting race. It's Sergio Perez on pole position today. Perez starts on Lewis pole. Lewis Hamilton completes With the front row. Hamilton Looking down the rest me. of the grid we have Verstappen, Bottas, Verstappen, Bottas, Fernando Alonso, Fernando and Sonoda, Yuki Sonoda, Stroll, Lance Stroll, Norris, and Charles Leclerc. Charles Leclerc. Charles Leclerc. With Charles Leclerc. Ricardo, with Sainz, Ricardo, with Carlos Sainz, Pierre Gasly, and Vettel, with Pierre Gasly, and with Sebastian Vettel. Mazepin, George Russell, and Kimi Raikkonen, Mick Schumacher, and Antonio Giovinazzi and with Antonio Giovinazzi, but from the back, from the back, of, the back, of, the back of the grid. Lights out, just moments away, it's time to go down to the track. Let's head to the track. Let's see what it does. Oh, we load it. It's not set up really quick. Let's yeah, we are in Bahrain. It's going to be dry in the Mercedes. Lights are about to go out in Bahrain and National Circuit. Let's get started. Waiting for the green lights. Here come the lights. Four, five red lights around now. And lights out and away we go. Great start right now for Perez and Verstappen. Boat is going to a good jump start right now as we're coming towards the breaking through turn number one. We're getting three, one for second. And, uh, uh, and I, I can see it is a little bit. I, I will get a first flashback for that. So I'll take I'll take the first flashback of the stream. All right, one flashback. Okay, we might have to cut a little bit to it. I'll just let other drivers. I'll just let the two rebels go stay out in front. Right? But we don't get DRS until lap three. That's now try and look into the inside on Bodas and we're going him into P3. Now next cut. So we have got Perez ahead of Max Verstappen and us. Here we go, breaking the turn eight. Now we're trying to look in the to the inside on Max Verstappen and we got him into P2. And retake and we're back up into P2. But here we come on Sergio Perez. And we're coming to the inside on Perez and we got Sergio Perez into P1. Nice, into turn 12, turn 11, now coming to turn 12. And we go quick as in sector two than anybody. Into turn 13. 1.0 the gap to Perez behind in P2. Down to the last two more turns into turn 14, heading into the turn 15. Points the gap. It's a line. Four laps remaining. A great long three. But you do not have the fat flat of the ball three. And now here we go. Moving to turn two. 
It's coming to turn one. Now it's a turn three. Now turn four. And one by nine now the gap. And we're coming to the break into turn number four. And the five Hercus for the first sector into six turning I mean into turn seven. Coming into his turn number eight. Just 3.1, the gap to Perez behind in P2. Here we go, it's a 10 and now it's coming to turn 9, turn 10. 3.6 now, the gap. Right now to get most Perez behind in P2. Here we go, into 3, into turn 11 now. Moving to turn 12, we go, now we go, quick is in second. There we go, only personal mix in sector 2 as we move into turn 13. 4.5, the gap to Perez behind the P2. Let's see what he does right now. Here we go. Slowing towards turn 14 and turn 15. There's a line out and we're 3 laps to the end of the Bahrain Grand Prix. 129. With a fast lap of the Grand Prix, DRS is now enabled. As around DRS is now enabled by race control. Turn one now, turn number two. Okay, you're creating some breathing space okay. between you and the car behind by a few seconds per lap. We're 5.5 now, the gap to Perez behind a P2. Coming to the break into turns, into turn three, into turn four. Now coming to five and six, and, and now into turn seven. Now into turn eight. This game, yeah. Going to turn nine and ten. And now with six point six, the camp to Perez behind the P2. Now into turns eleven. Now turn twelve. Turn thirteen. And now so. So we're set point four the camp to Perez behind the P2. So we're the camp. Here we go, he's coming to the break into turn 14 and 15. It's a line out two laps to go of the Bahrain Grand Prix. And we go fastest again, second three then many Eight point one the gap to Perez behind the P2. And the turn one. Now turn two, coming to turn three, there goes Per, as for Stappen, passes Per, and now Per, per stay on the front, but Stappen gets the jump, and will pass Sergio Perez into P2. Into turn four. Here we go towards turn five, turn six, into turn seven, into turn eight. Turn seven and turn eight now as we come into turn nine and turn ten. And very nice. As we move closer to the line now. 9.7 the gap to Perez to Verstappen behind in P2. Heading to turn 10 and 11. Here we go over oh, going a little bit wide. And now heading into turn 12. Now we're going to break into turn 13. Now come to turn 14 and turn 15 and now the line on to the final lap of the Bahrain Grand Prix. Final lap, final lap of the race. We're on the final lap of the race here at the Bahrain Grand Prix. Now coming to breaking towards turn 1. Now coming to turn 2 heading into turn 3. Here we go, coming to turn number four. In the turn four, 10.8, the gap to Max Verstappen behind P2. Five, in the turn five, coming to turn six. Coming to turn seven. Now coming to turn number eight. All right, here we go. Now 
we go. Coming to turn nine, coming to turn ten. The line now to very close indeed. Very close indeed. Here we go to so where's ten? Eleven. Coming to turn twelve. And now to here towards ten. 13. 13. 11 point nine, and with 12 point zero, the gap to the sapling behind P2. Here we go towards turn 14, and the last turn for turn 15, and then coming to see the checker flag, and we win the Bahrain Grand Prix. Out on that. Fantastic! You've won the Grand Prix. Very nice. And it's going to be Lando Norris. All right, Lando Norris, driver of the day. Very nice. A fantastic nice. team effort then to secure victory That's a here in the desert. As fireworks finish lining up from Anthony the sky. Davidson, what helped them deliver this result, do you think? Well, this I'm was not. a real team victory. They put together a solid not, strategy sir. today that appeared well suited to the conditions out on track. The driver did everything that was expected of them in the moment to really execute the team's plan to perfection. A shining example of how F1 really is a team sport. Mercedes are on top form once again after an excellent race weekend. It's great to see them up on that podium once again. Nice. And time for the champagne. Here we go. Please, my first stamp and don't. Please, no, don't. Please, don't for stamp and. Ah! Down the back. I spray the champagne. Up the podium. Very nice. Lewis Hamilton takes the lead of the Drivers' Championship. Let's focus on the driver of the day, Anthony Davidson. Who do you pick? It's got to be Lando Norris, hasn't it? Smooth, oh, confident Lando. and assured. Good, good, good choice. No doubt that he and his team are going to be over the moon with his performance good today. Well, Ants, an end to another fantastic weekend of racing. Thanks to everyone who joined us, and we'll see you for the next one. Nice. So we win the Bahrain Grand Prix with 7 minutes and 34, 32 seconds. Max for 7 seconds, and Perez will insert your Perez. We'll round up the podium, P2, P3 finish for Red Bull, Fazri Bowes comes third in fourth, Landon Norris fifth, Nacho sixth, you can start seventh, Marco eighth, last roll ninth, Charles Leclerc rounds up the top ten, Carl Sainz comes home at 11th for P10, P11 finish for Ferrari, Peter Gasly comes home at 12th, Dan Ricciardo 13th, Sebastian Villa 14th for the four-time former one world champion, George Russell 15th, Nicholas Latifi comes home in 16th, Kim Rankin in 17th, Mick Schumacher 18th, Antonio Giovanni 19th, and Nikita Massman will finish in 20th in last place. But let's look at the standings. And we take the lead, 26 ahead over Max Verstappen, and now the constructor standings, Mercedes take over the lead with 38 over Red Bull. Very nice. And next Grand Prix is going to be at Imola. That's coming up for tomorrow.